Do you want to organize all your leads in one place using Notion? You're in the right place. I'm Taina Perenemi, founder of a top-rated Notion certified consulting agency. I've helped countless entrepreneurs manage their sales pipeline in a simple and streamlined way using Notion. In this video, me and my team will show you the step-by-step -step in how you can create your own lead tracker on Notion from scratch. Follow along and by the end of this video, you will have your very own lead tracker ready to use. A healthy business requires a steady flow of new sales. To manage your sales effectively, you need a way to consistently track and manage your leads. Without a system to keep all information on your leads organized in one place, things can get overwhelming and messy quickly. If you need to search multiple documents, spreadsheets, notes, and your own memory to know what's happening with each lead in your sales pipeline, you will be doomed to waste a lot of valuable time and lose a lot of potential deals. Now, there are countless sales CRM tools out there like Pipedrive or HubSpot designed to help businesses optimize and streamline their sales process. However, most of these tools can be overly complicated for a small business owner just looking for something simple and easy to use. So what if you could do it in a simple and easy way using Notion? Notion is a popular tool that can be used to keep everything organized in one place in a highly customizable and user-friendly way. One great way to use Notion is to turn it into your lead tracker. Let me show you an example of a simple lead tracker built on Notion. Here we are in an example company, and I'm going to be now opening the example lead tracker that we will be building in this video. So basically, what we are going to build is a simple lead tracker to organize your whole sales pipeline in one place. You will be able to see an overview of all the steps of your sales process from left to right with the different companies or people going through your sales pipeline in the different steps. And when you open anyone's record, you will be able to see their status, if they're a hot lead, the link to a social media discussion to be able to easily open it when needed and the next follow-up date so that you will never forget to follow up with them. Also, you, you will be able to add sales call notes by clicking on this button and adding the uh, call notes under this little toggle. Then in addition to this overall sales pipeline view, we will be creating a due to follow-up view where you can see a list of all those leads that are due for following up with in the order of a follow-up date. Next, my team member Dunstan is going to show you the step-by-step -step how you can build your own lead tracker in Notion from scratch. To create the lead tracker, let's prepare our Notion page. Let's add the title here an icon here and a cover here and let's add something minimum perfect and let's set the page into full width Now that we have prepared our page, let's add our database. Let's add a database in board view. Let's modify our layout to hide the database title. Let's modify the properties and delete the assigned properties. Let's delete the status property as well. We can add more properties by clicking this card. 
for the status property, let's add the following options. Let's add our second one here. Our third one. Fourth one. Let's duplicate the cards to populate the database. Now that we have populated the database, let's rearrange the statuses. Let's modify the color of the statuses as well. Now we can add more properties. Let's click a card here and add a URL property. Let's name this property as discussion link. Let's add another property. Find the date property and rename it as follow up date. Let's add one more property and find select and add the following options. Let's copy an emoji here and paste it as an option. After preparing the properties, we can now add new templates to our database. Click this button here and select new template. Let's name this template as sales lead and modify the template by adding an icon. Let's set the status as lead in. For the body of the template, let's add two big section headings. The first one, let's name it as calls. And let's add the divider below. We can add the button here and name it as create new call no. Let's add an action by clicking this button here. Please select insert blocks. Inside the field here below, let's add a toggle heading. And name it as sales call with a placeholder 
for the date. Click Done. We can now add the second big section heading in our template. And let's add two blank bulleted lists block. Now that we've prepared the template, let's add more sample entries. We can now delete these cards in our database. Now, let's add one more database view in our lead tracker. Let's click the button here and name this view as due to follow up. Hide the database title and click done. After hiding the database title, let's modify the filters so that the database only shows items that are due for a follow-up on or before the current date. Let's click filter here and choose follow-up date. Click is on or before and select today. and click save for everyone. Now let's modify sort to sort the table according to their follow-up date. Click sort and click follow-up date. And click save for everyone. To finalize our lead tracker, let's select a lead here and rename this select property. After renaming, let's try to make these properties appear on our board view by clicking the menu here. Click Properties and toggle these on. Now your lead tracker is done. You have now created your very own lead tracker on Notion. Congrats! Would you like to build a fully customized Notion CRM, not just for sales, but for tracking all client engagements and projects? Do you have a vision of what you want to create, but don't know how to use Notion well enough to make it happen? Would you like to also automate and integrate the CRM with your other tools? Let's have a chat to see how we can create your custom system done for you to help you close more deals with ease. I've included in the description a link to book a free discovery call with me to discuss your needs in detail and to evaluate if we would be a good fit to work together. Thank you so much, guys. If you enjoyed the video, please don't forget to give us a thumbs up and do subscribe to our channel to get more Notion tutorials and tips for managing your business. See ya!